It's funny you bring that up because Rambo's next war is against the iPhone. <laughs> we're, we're, I'm going to take them all out. I'm, gonna, I'm going. I'm going to start in China, work my way around the world. Now, it's actually Instagram was a joke. Like my daughter said, "Oh, I well, want you know, like get on Instagram," and I thought it was okay. And before I knew it, I thought it was fun. So I would. It's my personality to, to just kind of like do a very odd thing on Instagram. You know, I started, when I started out in films, I really believed it, it was more personal, more handmade. We didn't have technology. So, for example, when I would direct Rocky, the studio would say, you have 50,000 feet, period. Now, when we did Creed, because they're on tape, we had over 2 million feet. So, when you have a lot less, you tend to be a little bit more specific, you rehearse more, you, you don't, um, you, you're more prepared. So I think technology has made um, things a little easier, but it also has given birth, and uh, no, seriously, you I could comment on this, with the way actors have to learn to act today. There's a new form of acting with the green screen and technology where you don't have realism and you have to pretend and I tried it like when I was working with uh, Robert Rodriguez and he says a giant monster is coming don't be afraid it's huge it's a hundred meters tall and he's holding a pencil I go, it's scary he goes no but that pencil will be a hundred meters tall someday so when I look at actors that have to create in their own mind when nothing is there, it's, it's hard. You know what I mean? I, I, I couldn't do it. How about you? Can you do it? Es un poco difícil, pero sí lo puedo hacer. <laughs> no, because they're, they're doing like these fantasy cat women and things like that. And, and I'm, I'm, I'm amazed by the new technology that actors have to incorporate in their skill set where it's gone. Because, I mean, like Game of Thrones, 90% of Game of Thrones, and it's fantastic is green screen. That's amazing that these actors can be so good. So yeah, it's affected and it's going to continue to affect. Pretty soon they're going to be taking our faces <laughs> and sticking them on other people. They will never die. <laughs> I believe that even with all the technology, there's certain basics that, that people like a simple story. Well acted, but simple. And they're so inundated today with so many scientific uh, inventions, so much high tech, so much incredible magic, uh, magic behind the filmmaking. I mean, it's really extraordinary what they can do. They can create an ocean out of one drop of water. But the one thing you can't, you can't duplicate is human emotion. So when you keep it really simple and you keep it identifiable that you, 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 and every one of you would do what Rambo could do if you could do it, then you have the audience with you. If every one of you could feel the way, like Rocky goes into the ring, he's scared to death. He, he, he's prepared to lose. And you all would feel the same way if you were walking into the ring. So it's identifiable. When the character becomes so strong, that nothing can happen to him, and I've made this mistake in movies, you might as well go home. There's, there's, you don't feel anything for him, so you must identify with his weaknesses and help him along. Because strength is easy. Anyone can pretend to be strong, but when you're, when, you have, when you're afraid, you have, like Rambo is not, he, he's not bulletproof, he can die. And, and he, but he's, what he's fighting for, is worth dying for. But he doesn't want to, he's afraid. I just don't show it, but he's afraid. He's afraid, that's the way I think about it. I'm going there like, ah, I really have to think about this. One mistake and I go, one mistake and I go. Anyway, to answer your question, there is certain, that's why all, I love watching the older films. They're, they're much more in attuned to human emotions. And we all share the same, fears, and wants, and needs, 
and loneliness and the need to be appreciated. We all have this in common. And if you can touch on those, the audience is with you. And that's why I still believe Rambo, as long as he stays humble, and he, he's an underdog, same with Rocky, there'll always be a home for him. Wow.